Hi, this is Derek with Automatic Door and Hardware. Today we are going to be programming a 433 megahertz um, A100 series receiver um, and transmitter. Um, I'm gonna wire up the receiver first, um, get power to the unit um, to show you what the programming process looks like. Let's get into it. Um, so the A100 series looks like this. And this is the 433 megahertz model. They do have a 900 series model, which is going to be in a clear plastic instead of this blue plastic. Um, however, wiring and everything is identical. Um, it does come already wired and ready to go on the terminal block. Um, this right here is just an antenna. Um, if you have any issues with uh, signal transmission, maybe, maybe your door is only operating um, part of the time um, with, but not with every uh, button push. Um, it might be wise to open up your header cover and let this uh, stick out um, so that you can get that range. Uh, so anyways, here we go. Uh, we, have, um, we have four wires here. So uh, these come out of the factory set up for a normally open um, contact. So, you know, your black and your red are gonna be your power um, and it's 1224 AC or DC. And then your white and your green are gonna be for your uh, activation. So um, white is gonna be a common, and then your green is gonna be the actual activation signal. <clears throat> so I'm going to go ahead and wire this in. I have a um, in fact, I'm gonna remove it here because I already have wires ready to go. Remove the power wires here. Okay. Okay. All right. These are non polarity sensitive as well. snug we are going to power up the unit okay so we have power to the unit um, now there is you can see right now I have power running through the unit you there is nothing that uh, no LED indicator that shows that there's power on it um, easy way to check just hit the one of the learn buttons hold it down for a second and you'll see so it lit up so we got power um, and now we will go over um, a couple tricks here. So with this receiver, <coughs> it's a little bit tricky. So when we hold the learn button, what's gonna happen is it's gonna light up that LED and it's going to wait for your signal from your push plate. Um, now you can get a couple of, uh, I've had customers call in and say that, you know, hey, it's programmed because every time they push the button, the board lights up, but it's not actually activating the door opener. Um, so this receiver actually will understand and, and read an incoming signal even though it is not programmed to it. So um, what you can see here is what, if I press this button, it's gonna light up over here even though this is not programmed and the relay does not close. See? So you can see it, it flashes twice. It can kind of confuse you um, into thinking that you've programmed it when, when you haven't. Um, so here is the programming process. <coughs> We have, um, with this receiver, you have a learn with delay and a learn with no delay. This is our preferred receiver when we are gonna be working with a vestibule application where you want the first door to open immediately when you push the outside uh, push plate. Um, and then you want the uh, interior door to activate maybe five to 10 seconds after. Um, and that's just to save on uh, energy uh, efficiency so you don't get a huge gust of wind um, coming through. <coughs> so this is our preferred receiver for that. So the button right here is to learn with delay. So the delay is adjustable from zero to 30 seconds right on this potentiometer. Um, 
So if you want it to delay before it operates, so you push the button and then it holds the signal and waits for that specific amount of time. So maybe five seconds, so it'll obviously count one, two, three, four, five, and then it will send the signal to the door opener and activate your door. Um, for our purpose, I'm just gonna learn it in the normal way um, with no delay. The learn with no delay is right here on the edge. Um, and this is the button we are gonna use, going to use to learn. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hold this down. It's now in learn mode. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna press the button. And it was as simple as that. I had the push plate very close, so it was very easy to learn. It picked it up right away. So now let's press the push plate and see how the blue light went on. That means that it actually activated the door um, or it sent out closed to contact right here um, so that your door opener can open. Um, before, when it wasn't learned, you see that it flashed right here, but it did not actually turn blue. So if you get the blue, if you get the blue, that means you've actually learned it properly and you're good to go. If you get the um, red, um, double try programming. Um, again, if you bring the push plate or transmitter closer to the actual receiver, you'll have an easier time. Um, so that's how we wire up the A100 series. Thank you guys.